Matt was my childhood friend. Uh, I grew up with him since elementary school. And Sarah, I knew her from a summer camp we worked together at, and later in life we reconnected. I've been searching my whole life for you. Matt, I remember meeting you about four years ago. Here I am four years later, looking at the man in my dream. Life can be dull without joy. When I found you, I not only found joy, but I also found my best friend. Sarah, I love you, and I'm so happy to be a part of this day with you. I only wish for you both to be happy and live in the moment. It goes by so very fast. Matthew, you take this woman to be your lawful wedded wife, to have and to hold in sickness and in health, in good times and in woe, for richer or poorer, keeping yourself unto her for as long as you both shall live? If so, answer, I do. I do. Sarah, do you take this man to be your lawful wedded husband, to have and to hold in sickness and in health, in good times and woe, for richer or poorer, keeping yourself unto him as long as you both shall live? If so, answer, I do. I do. Now, by the power invested in me in the state of Connecticut, I now pronounce you man and wife. And kiss the bride. Matt and Sarah, I know you will have your challenges as all relationships do, but you know what's great about love and relationship and marriages? It's about learning together. Matt, today I vow to you this. I vow to love you unconditionally and to love you Christ-like. I vow to take care of your kind heart and to always love you with all of mine. Today and out, I vow to love you. I promise to always strive to be a good man and a loving man you can be proud of to soon call your husband. <laughs> <laughs>